We are not in the London Stadium, neither are we at the Gurusan Park. We are in Mumbai as we deck up for match day four, match number 15 of the Premier League Next Generation Cup, brought to you by the Lands Foundation. A fine, balmy evening in Navi Mumbai at the Lands Corporate Park as West Ham United are ready to take on Everton. Let's have a look at the team list then. Well, of course, the Lotus Kogan side come up with five, six changes, in fact, uh, in the last encounter against Selin Bosch. We have the likes of Mason Terry between the sticks alongside uh, Sean Tarima. A change coming. Regan Clayton also Tyron Apkata in the defence. Next up, we have Everton on the other end. Look like four changes for the Kieran Driscoll side. We have Seb Jensen between the sticks. Roman Dixon alongside Edward Jones and Oren Smith in the defence, followed by Callum Batis, Halik Jankpata, the man who got the goal. So there, here's Luke Butterfield. Quickly gets in the ball. Everton are prowling in now. Getting in search. Dossard gets an important touch up from Mason Terry. Uh, pulls up a fine save for West Ham United. Again, the run of play, of course. Uh, Everton, who have been uh, on the defensive end. Uh, here's a chance then. Quick turn then from Kodua, who gets inside the box. Uh, here comes all his goals. Uh, <laughs> Close it away. This time gets a touch and it's in. Yes, it's in. And Kaelin Casey, well, we are still uh, trying to understand. The referee has blown the whistle there. Was it an offside? We're just trying to understand. It's not been given. And we can confirm from the center. It's not been given. Contentious there. What really happened there? We're trying to understand. Somehow just got multiple touches on its way into the back of the net. But uh, not given there is how we can confirm then. Attempt. Heads at this time, a crucial touch. Back again, West Ham. George Odi there. He's everywhere, isn't he? He's everywhere on that field. Great prospect for the first team. An incredible uh, talent totting youngster. In comes West Ham now. Again intercepted, still a chance this time. A crucial save. It was George Odi yet again with a left footed attempt. Quite instinctively there. Saves Everton from conceding that first goal. Look at that for a finish. In fact, it was uh, Regan Clayton uh, came in forward. Last couple of minutes, uh, the momentum slightly tilting towards the hammers. Here's a ball inside. Then here's a chance. And I'll tell you what, uh, West Ham Zero doesn't wear a mask or a cape. He wears a number 10 jersey. What a lovely strike there. Uh, West Ham United were prowling time and again. And then this finish uh, wraps it all up. Yo, they're moving again. Regan Clayton uh, back again at the door. It's a second. It's a second and how. All he scores. Doubles the advantage here for West Ham United. Easy finish there for uh, all he scores who's been lurking around for quite some time there. A left-footed effort into the back of the net. 2-0 West Ham United and looks like a goodbye for Everton right now. This time yet again, oh, what a goal! A thundering header by the skipper, Kodua, who was led from the front. I told you about the third one coming in and this is how it comes. Brilliant connect at the back of the net. Here's another chance. If they get four, oh, he's brought down. He's brought down, still in. But this could be the fourth goal line clearance. We'll have a look at this, how it happened. Yes, Kodu, oh, well, he was going in for that. Uh, it was uh, Edward Jonas. And uh, Kodu uh, has his chance uh, to become a prominent figure at the Rams Corporate Park. Uh, can he pull off the goal is the question. And it's saved, Seb Jensen. With a spectacular save, diving towards his left, denying Kodua with a three-year. The hat-trick was on the way, but uh, kudos to Seb Jensen from Everton. Pulls off an absolute blinder. What a way to bring back things for West Ham United. Uh, here they are for another one. Lovely pass that. Uh, a quick touch and go. But uh, Kodua, it was uh, on the receiving end of that pass. Uh, needed a toucher from Shantarima there. And there it is, uh, Crystal John blows that final whistle in a game which has seen three goals only for the West Ham United side. Everton have fought valiantly from the toffees there. They've given their hearts out. 
But the story in the half time, in the full time, in fact, uh, it's West Ham United 3 and Everton 0.